Hey, good morning, everyone. Look how beautiful the mountains are behind me. Greetings from Palm Springs, California. Now I'm here in front of construction site, and I'm gonna tell you in a minute what this is. I was planning to come by here oh, a couple of weeks ago, maybe a month ago, to uh, videotape this for one of my vlogs, and I just hadn't gotten over here the, until this morning. Um, I was, uh, while I was having my breakfast, I was reading online that uh, they're finally demolishing this building that I was going to come over here to uh, to uh, capture on video. So I thought, well, I better get over here before it's gone. Uh, you have to be fast in Palm Springs. Uh, so many of the old uh, landmarks and buildings are being demolished. Uh, it's very sad, I think. But I'm trying to capture as many of, as I can. Now this one really isn't, his, um, well, it's historical in a way, but it's not really architecturally that significant. The building's not that, that uh, great of a building, but uh, it was owned by uh, Sonny Bono. And uh, this was his restaurant. When he first came to Palm Springs, he opened a restaurant here in, uh, in Palm Springs on Indian Canyon Drive. And uh, it was opened in 1986. And there's a story that he had so many problems with City Hall with various you know things while he was trying to open the restaurant that he became so frustrated that he decided to run for mayor so he could change a lot of the um, um, rules and regulations and things that made it so difficult to open a restaurant here I guess and uh, he actually won in 1988 he became uh, mayor of uh, Palm Springs and uh, the rest is sort of history but uh, I'm gonna see if I can, they've got everything fenced off, unfortunately. I should have come uh, a month ago when I was first thinking about it. Everything is fenced off and it's very difficult to see. Um, it's going to be, as you can see, 64 at the Riv. Now the Riv, I'm sure, is because in reference to the Riviera Hotel, which is the famous Riviera Hotel that's uh, right next door. You can see all those uh, trees and bushes there. That's the Riviera Hotel. Uh, famous for so many things. The Rat Pack uh, used to uh, hang out there and uh, Palm Springs Weekend uh, was filmed partially there. If you've ever seen it, you'll recognize uh, much of the um, much of the hotel. And so let me see. I'm seeing if I can get to a vantage point where I can uh, uh, maybe look over the fence and give you a, an idea of what the uh, restaurant looked like. So I'm going to turn the camera around and see what we can see here. And it's really early in the morning. It's not even sunrise. As you can see, the sun is just coming up. You can see it on the mountains, which is really beautiful. But I'm gonna take my walk in this neighborhood this morning and then I'll come back and uh, see if I can get a better uh, image uh, once the sun has come up a little bit. So sorry for my rambling. Uh, I'm just a little, I'm not quite awake, I don't think, yet this morning. And although I do ramble anyway all the time. So, uh, so let me turn the camera around, see what we can see before the sun is right in our eyes. And I'm going to stand up on this fence here. I think that might help a little bit. So as you can see, the sun is just rising and the... Um, the building is mostly in silhouette, so it's a little bit difficult to see, but I'll come back uh, after my walk and uh, once the sun is up a little bit and see if I can get uh, uh, a better uh, image to show you. I'm just glad to see that I got here in time to at least capture um, uh, this image before the building is demolished, which I would guess is probably going to happen in the next uh, week or so. So there are a couple of other interesting things about this restaurant. Uh, according to a number of sources, this is where he met his wife, uh, Mary Whitaker, who had become uh, Mary Bono. Apparently she was a waitress at the uh, restaurant. Then in 1990, Sonny and the restaurant were embroiled in controversy because he was mayor and uh, the Virginia Slims Tennis Open chose his restaurant and tennis club 
as the site to hold the 1991 uh, tournament. So for this and other reasons, in 1991, he put the uh, popular Italian restaurant up for sale. At the time, it was reported that the uh, property was being purchased by the owners of the Riviera Hotel next door, but I believe it's just remained uh, vacant for all of these years. So as always, thanks for watching. And if you ever ate at uh, uh, Sonny Bono's uh, restaurant, uh, please uh, leave a comment in the comment section. I'd love to know what it was like. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and uh, share it.